Hi, I'm calling from DoorDash. I understand that you're having an issue receiving your red card. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, why don't you go ahead and run down just uh, a little bit of uh, of what's going on here. I understand that you're trying to uh, get a secondary red card, uh, but there is an address switch that was requested. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. Um, and the, is the, you do uh, address it within the same city? Um, it's Bowie, Maryland. It's Bowie, Bowie, Maryland. Okay. I mean, the last address was, was Temple Hills, and I'm and I'm there at in Law, Maryland. I'm sorry. Okay, I understand. And so let's look. So, did you have an initial red card, or and it was lost, and this is a replacement, or is this just a uh, um, your your no. first one where your your other one just didn't arrive in the mail? Yeah, this is my first one. I've been trying to get this for over a year, and and I've never gotten the card. Okay, and which can I ask you which website did you signed up for? Uh, I, when you went to the website, did you just go to DoorDash dot com? Uh huh. I I went to DoorDash, um, and it says, um, "Do you want to be a dasher?" And I said, right. "Yeah," and I put it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I see. So, do you want to be a dasher? And it's asking for you know if you're a a customer or a dasher. I understand. Okay, I see exactly what had happened here. Um, unfortunately, it appears that you signed up under the uh, White's DoorDash. You needed to actually sign up under the Black's DoorDash. No. Uh, because what we do is we we like we tend to send the White DoorDashes to the nicer neighborhoods, uh, and then when there's a really risky high risk delivery. We like to uh, send the black door dashers. Um, you would think you would make a little more money going in on a high risk delivery, but actually, what we do is we cut your rates in half, and then we take your tips and we spread them amongst the uh, the white dashers. They get your tips, so you only get the uh, the base pay half the base pay. Normally, it's three dollars. This time, it's a dollar fifty for each delivery. Oh, okay. And I just want so, to let you know that you're contract you're contractually uh, obligated to perform at least fifty deliveries a week. You pay for your own gas since you're a uh, contractor with us. You're a ten ninety nine contractor, and if you don't complete fifty deliveries a week for the next year, then we'll we'll disconnect we'll disconnect you, and then we'll have to go ahead and I guess get our money from you at court. Oh. Oh. Okay. I, so, I the, so I, I had the no, I had the right person, right? You, you were the one that wanted the red card, right? Okay, great. All right, yeah, no, we're gonna what we're gonna do is I'm gonna make a switch. I'm gonna send you out the it's it's not the red card. I'm gonna send you out the blacks red card, and then what we'll we'll go ahead and do is we'll we'll ship that to you. Uh, well, I'm sorry, did well, you have my questions? Da- my daughter has have a red card. Why do I need a black red card? I don't understand. Because you're African American. Is your daughter African American? I guess I could clarify that as well. I don't want to make assumptions or anything like that because, you know, different strokes for different folks. There's mixed families and there's uh, stepdaughters, you know, things like that. That's fine. But uh, was she African American? And if she got just a regular red card, I'm going to need her information because we're going to have to bring her up on fraud charges. Okay, I don't. I don't. Never mind. I'll give you five. I'll give you five hundred dollars right now to snitch on your daughter. I I don't want to do this. Never mind, sir. I don't know who you are. Hey, who do you think you're fucking with? You think we're Grubhub or something? (laughs) Huh? We're not Grubhub. Yeah, we're not Grubhub. Think we're some low class (laughs) motherfuckers? Huh? Hello? Yeah, hi. <laughs> you know what? What? Go you work for crazy. Uber Eats. Go work for Uber Eats. You crazy. I know I'm crazy. That's why I work here. I've been demoted. I used to work over in the white, the white side of the company, and then I got demoted. And they sent me over to the African-American side. We used to call it the minority <laughs> side, but then we got in a little bit of trouble, and we didn't want to deal with that in court anymore. Hey, could you break? Could you get your manager on here, please, uh, Miss Flater? You need a. You want the manager? 
Manager, I need to speak with Miss Flader, please. Okay. Manager on duty, please step to the floor. Flader. Hello, yeah, this is Flader speaking. How can I help you? Flader, we have somebody on here that needs your help. Could you please give us a hand? What? What the problem? What's the problem? Well, we're having we're having some problem we're having some problems here uh, with with the the, the milk the Dwight man. He's got deliveries, and then we're having a real problem here, Dwight. Yeah, it's it's not my problem. My deliveries are on time. I got some old lady well, on here who owes us money because she's not she's not dashing right. She won't tell us about her daughter who's a fraudulent hussy. She's sitting there working on the white side, and that's not where she belongs. Well, that's that. Well, that's unfortunate. Excuse me, ma'am. You need to speak the fuck up and talk to my manager. I can hear you breathing. That's okay, because I'm, I'm recording everything, so I can take Hey, hey, you can't it. record us, because we record for quality and training purposes. You don't have permission. Oh, oh, I'm I'm taking this to the police. To the, bo- to to the police? Them. What the police going to do? Ma'am, are you shaking your head back and forth while you said that? Don't get the finger snapping, because I'll do it first. I will snap in your face. You are so crazy. I'm trying to figure out what's going on here. <laughs> you crazy as hell. Talk to my manager. Talk to the manager. Quit talking to me. I don't no, want to talk I'm, to you no more. I don't want to talk to you. You call me. They're going to make fuck. me work in the basement. They're going to move me to the basement, and they're going to take away my swing line stapler if you don't talk to the manager. Hold on. Just calm. Just calm down. What is the problem in here? Fuck you. That's what the problem is. Not, Hold on. Not I want y'all to keep talking. Hold on a second. I'm trying to figure out what your problem is. I'm trying to fix your problem. What are you cussing at me for? Hello? Smart of you. Eat your grab hub or something. All y'all need Jesus. Y'all need to go to church. Well, you know what? I have Jesus. You ain't no Jesus. What church are you going to do? Don't worry about what church I go to. What church you go to? You know, I'm going to pray for you. Hold on. Oh, I go to. Oh, my, my love. You mm-hmm. shall. You there? Yeah. Y'all ain't got nothing better to do. You ain't got no jobs or nothing? I, I work for Grubber. Yeah, and door dash mm-hmm. at the same time. Mm-hmm. How many jobs you got? You trying to get one here. Y'all crazy as hell. Y'all ain't got nothing better to do than to call people's phones this time of night and, 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 and do this, right? Well, what would you do then? I want you to not call my phone not another time. Why not? Because I don't want you to call my phone not another time. I'm trying to give you a job. And I don't want your job. Apparently you do. No, I don't. I don't want your job. I'll never work for y'all. Never. Well, you as, a matter of fact, as a matter of fact, I yeah, this is an unknown number. You call me from an unknown number, so that means that you're that wherever I went to today and I got the information, I will report it to the Better Business Bureau. When wherever I went today Wait. to sign up. Well, listen here. Well, listen here. Hold on. Hold on. Let me let me talk. Now, Go listen ahead, here. talk. Listen here. Now, I'm trying to help you get a job, and you over here cussing at my employee. <laughs> uh, um, boss, ma'am, sir, dog, bitch, whatever you are. I'm going to pray for you. 